And we're back. That's an unfortunate pose. Oh, it is. I didn't even look at that. <laughs> Kat, what are you doing? Uh, yeah, we went and we got some drinks in between episodes. Because you're still sick. Yeah, so got some tea. She made me tea and had honey yep. in it. It's it's good tea. Oh, good. So I like that tea a lot. It's tension tamer tea. Nice. It's just a bag tea, but I think it's really nice. I drink a lot of it. Cat wants tea. Cat All right. doesn't know what tea is. It's but he time wants tea. to go fix the radio. Let's yes. go. Radio time. All right. I don't remember where we're. All right. To that. To there. Yeah. To where that light is. Okay. Is where you're gonna ultimately end up. So you have to figure out how to get there. Knock it off. I can on that one. Uh, Whoa! <laughs> all right, so all oh, the way over the there. So, might as well just start heading in that direction. In the bucket. The good news is. Well, anyway, never mind. Bucket. Wee. Rooftops. Time for danger. Oh. All right. Oh. There they are. <laughs> Here right. we go. All right. Uh, shoot. <clears throat> you can do it. So you're going to look over to the left. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, just go ahead and go for it. Wait, what? You can attract them to make them go one way so you can Oh, I was else. like, why? Why would I do that? I'm actually not sure where you're supposed to go. Yellow light. Climb up there. There you go. Oh, they chased me. So yeah, you can use your, your you can call out to get them to go one direction, so can you can run to where you want to go. So it looks like you want to call them over here so they go away yeah, from there. Yeah, so I can, like... And then you're going to run across that steel beam. Maybe climb down first so you uh -huh. have time to get up on the steel beam. There they come. Run! Run, 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 run! Run, 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 run. AC units? Yeah. 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 They can jump. Oh. The, uh, what do they call them? Zerks? Yeah. What a name. I feel like that reminds me of something from when I was a kid. Animorphs? Yerks. Maybe? You read those books too. Some of them at least, right? I read like, Animorphs? all of them. Like, I really liked those books. Yeah. Um, there's also, if we're talking Starcraft, there's... Uh, Zerg. That might be what I was thinking. I of. like the Zerg. There's like the three races. Jump on the that same steel beam. Oh, okay. Oh, it'll there's go the, the other way. There's the people course, and then there's like the, um, I forget what they're called. Protoss. And then Pro there's the, the Zerg, and I like to play as the Zerg if I have a choice. I think that's what it is, because like, mm -hmm. I don't think I've played that, but like, I've heard you talk about mm -hmm. it. You can play, it's free to play for the first five levels for each oh, commander character. Yeah, I think so. Sounds if you're talking about um, the co-op mode, story mode, I think you have to pay for it, but that's reasonable. Is it on, like, Steam? I forgot if you uh, just said that. They have, it's on, I think it's a Blizzard game, maybe? It's, uh, they have their own launcher. See, like, the pink here makes me suspicious, Gross. but I don't see anything. I think you're good to go. Awesome. Yeah, oh, I remember this puzzle. All right. So we knocked that down. Can't go back. That's fine. You don't want to. Anymore. Oh, that's what. That's why they knocked it down. So. Oh. We had to, like, get them. So you need to get across, but the problem is they're going to get you. So what you need to do is you're going to close. The gates will alternate. So go ahead and hack the door. <laughs> Hacking. Hacking. All right. Thing. Good. So. Ew, they're so disgusting. What, what do they those look things? like? They look like blob ticks. So what you're going to do Ew, is you're going to hack the door again and then run to run across and jump across that platform. Go ahead. Jump again. I'm trying. You! Yeah, there you go. Good. And you're good. Don't do it again. Oh, because it'll let him in. That. <laughs> so you're good. You're on the other <coughs> side. <coughs> because you need to use that that uh, barrel, yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't have been able to do it with them there. It's like, the barrels I remember. I don't actually remember any of these puzzles except the barrel stuff. Ah. Because I struggled with that. Like, not that I didn't do poorly on the other stuff, but the barrel, for whatever reason, it was, like, such a simple thing. <laughs> Other way. 
There we go. Yee. That looks like a very convenient walkway for a cat. It does. Catwalk. Whoa. Gross. This area is huge. It moves, too. I don't think I noticed that it moves like that the last time. That makes me uncomfortable. Have you ever been on, like, a bridge and felt the bridge, like, Yes. <laughs> Jump up and down when cars ride on it. I actually kind of think it, that's fun, but it freaks out. It's like, kind of unsettling if it, you're not expecting it. It freaks out my nieces and nephew. Oh, yeah, because yeah, there's that one bridge that you walk across. Mm -hmm. in there's, there's that one, the big blue one. And then there's a... Uh, we need to get in this door? No. Okay. Jump down. Um, there's no place to knock off this bucket. Gross. All right, so where are we heading now? Climb up. But not there. Here. Mm -hmm. I think. Oh, yes. <laughs> um, so there's that big blue bridge, but then there's like a smaller wooden bridge, and the mm -hmm. wooden bridge feels so unstable. <laughs> we can go in there. Do we want to go in here? You have to. Oh, we do. <laughs> it's disgusting. It makes squelchy noises. Oh, that, yeah. <laughs> I didn't see the board, but I saw that I could climb up here and mm -hmm. not there. Creaking. Wait, don't jump down yet. Yeah. Alright, so you see all of them? See if you can... Uh, so, Alright. So you. So if you look off to the right, there's a light over there. Mm. That's where you want to get to. So... We need th They can jump them. over. You're going to try to... Call them one direction. And then you're going to run the opposite way. So, so like, like, try to get them to go all in one area. And, of course, you're just going to have to keep moving because there's no safe spot down there. So try to call them to one area and then run the other way. I hope I don't Good luck! Die. They hear you. Ah! Oh, no! Button! I forgot what button. <laughs> I died. <laughs> well. I forgot what button oh, to run. Oh, sad. I forgot what button to run. Mm. It's like I had my escape plan and then I forgot the button. Oh, I died. Okay. Again. Trying this again. Because luckily it doesn't like make you start all the way over. Yeah. Okay. The game wants you to be able to finish it, so. They're, they're coming though. You better move. Move. No, please. Bum, bum, bum. Man, when they get on, I can't press it fast enough. Uh, you might want to move sooner than you do. Yeah. I was waiting for them to like come towards me a bit more, but then I guess they're a little they moved faster than fast, I think. Yeah. Didn't I get you an achievement the last time? Wait, what just happened? Did you meow at them? What on earth? You might want to move before they get to you. Yeah. Because then you won't be able to get down. Run, 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 run. There you go. Oh. No, it's gonna happen again, so. Oh. Uh, I didn't see them. You can jump across. Yep, there you go, exactly. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah. Whee. He sounded like he said, hang on. Careful. Is it again? Oh, it's again, isn't okay. it? Okay. This is similar to that first puzzle with the hacking the door. So what you're going to want to do is, ha okay, go back, sw swing back around. So you want all of them on the other side, wait, stop for a second. So that red barrel over there, you want yeah. all of them over on that side, if you can. So what red you're going to do is you're going to hack the door and then you're going to run around to the other side of that fence. Oh, and they're inside of that Wait, they're already in there. Well, yeah, no. It's where the red barrel is. I do not see a red barrel. It's... Turn to the left. That red right barrel? Right there. No, turn. Right there. Oh, uh, that's oh, a Oh, it's a box. Sorry, it's a box. <laughs> I didn't so, see... So, the red thing. Okay. So, you're gonna you're gonna want to run all the way around. You're gonna hack it. Start hacking, because you can run while he's hacking. Okay. Start the hack, and then run. And just, just run for it. And then... Yeah. As soon as... And they're going to try to follow you. You want as many of them out of there as possible. So go ahead. Run. Run, 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 run. Meow at them and stuff. See where they are. I don't know where they are. Oh, All right, no. move, move, move. Jump Four. up on the, the, the red barrel. On the red barrel. 
Yes. And then you need to get in and hack the door again. Yeah. Prompt. Or prompt. Prompt. Hack it again. No, not from that side. Prompt. No. Oh, great. Camera. Camera. The dog is ringing her bell again. Oh, it looks like they're just gonna stay there. Actually, maybe <laughs> that we don't need to hack the door. All right, ha unhack the door again. So open unhack the door. It? Unhack it. So you're gonna open the door because it looks like they're not gonna go to that side. They're just stuck in that corner there. So oh, just get okay. in that barrel. And then roll it through. Mm -hmm. Watching y'all. Because it looks Oops. like they're not gonna follow you. So that would be good. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> but just in case you might want to hurry yeah jump oh. up on the barrel <laughs> buttons work with me i don't know why really lily is having so much trouble okay so here uh-huh so lure them to one side and then run to the other yep exactly keep moving keep moving red thing yep And then this one is the timed one. You just have to survive long enough to get in oh the God. elevator. I died a lot on that you one. You did. My button mashing ability is You need is to practice very your button mashing. Oh, because I was pushing the wrong button. <laughs> I just realized it. No wonder I died earlier. Yeah, that'll do it. I was pushing the wrong button. Uh, ah. Well... This time we live. And we attempt to pull this lever. Now a real cat would just jump up on one of those, uh, some of that scaffolding and just <laughs> sit there, but, yeah. you know. Preemptive mashing. Sag and zag. This was a bad choice. Yeah, probably. Bad choice, bad choice. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Button prompt. That was weird. There you go. Now you're safe. Yay. Oops, wrong button. Hacking! <laughs> Gross. Aha, this time we lived. Didn't I, last time I was playing it, didn't I get you the achievement for nine lives? Because I <laughs> died so much. <laughs> oh man, I got to the end of my drink. <coughs> you have to climb out. Whee. Use item. You. We lights. You did it. And we only died a few times. Four times. Five times. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, as as we learned earlier today, that's just what happens when you're pressing the wrong buttons. Yep. <laughs> we both kind of struggled with that. <laughs> hey, on the way back. Mm hmm. You go, get to go on a nice <coughs> bucket ride. <coughs> Look, the view. It's beautiful from here. I remember now. The city. It was meant to be a shelter. Those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof sealing off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can go out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, unlivable, and dangerous. But if you came from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the outside, it was to open the city. <coughs> 
I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now that this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo. Now that we've connected the transmitter, we should be able to get help. New memory! Hey, it's in real order. That is a loud noise. <laughs> Use a cutscene to <laughs> drink loudly and cough. <coughs> the slums part two. Wee. <gasps> Excellent. Yes. These are some odd rugs. Oh, All right, I have to press triangle to stop. Like they're not bad. They're just oh, odd. Oh, a note. Oh right. Yeah, get, get down. It looks like a. Look, a note. <laughs> <laughs> Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of their antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is... See, I can't memorize <laughs> that, though. Be careful, as it is case sensitive. See you at the bar. Momo. That's, that's great. I'm glad we have a little robot with us. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Can we open this? Yeah. Here's the lock for the window. The code was... I think it was an H, I think. The... Error. Wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Let's try that again. <coughs> and then it was O, or was it an uppercase O? Oh, I thought that was a zero. Uh, sometimes zero has a line through it. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Success. Success. It worked. Mom was at the bar waiting for us. Am I old enough to be there? Go to the bar? Yes. <laughs> I mean, they don't drink alcohol at the bar. They are robots. Also, he looks like a full-grown cat, so, you know. Alright, I do not know where the bar is. Alright, it's gonna be on the bottom level. Okay. Basketball! <gasps> a basketball! Is there a hoop that I could not get into? I don't think so. Oh. It's like new goal for today. Let's find the bar. <laughs> <laughs> also, this one looks like it works. Vending machine! We need this, <coughs> though. I don't remember who uh, wanted it, but like Woo! somebody wanted this stuff. Yeah, you need it to trade. I think there's a couple up on the roofs and I forgot to look for it. Oh. Whoa, okay. Sleeping. Well, you have to talk to him first. Before sleeping? Well, you don't have to, but now you're just sleeping. We can take another nap. You can talk to him and then sleep. Give him some piano, uh, guitar music and then sleep. <laughs> Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Uh, let's go with that one. The Ballad of the Lonely Robot. <coughs> I think I can play this. Look. forever because you were <laughs> laying there. Talk with Morosuke. 
Oh, thank you for that music. I will practice. Do you think you can find more? Number five. Oh, you don't have the one I like. Well, okay. Should we give another one or you next can one? if you want to get it out of your inventory? Yeah. Cool down. <laughs> I think I can play this. Look. There's a bag nearby. <gasps> there it yes. is. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. Oi. <laughs> no, my bag. I wanted to lay down with my bag. Hello. I take care of the plants. The humans improved them so much. Now they require very little light. I just add a bit of water and look how big they get. It really is an amazing technology. Do you have something for him? No. Okay. He wants something. Roshi. Uh, I think... I think it just is happy to talk to you. Okay. It has the same hat as Momo. Oh, yeah. The same I... pattern. Bar time! Oh yeah, I read him. <laughs> hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. Dude, he bumped into him. Let me up in here. I'm trying, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. Oh, he petted my head. Let me see if I can get this thing working. Oh, dialogue. <laughs> I've almost got it. I'll read the other one. <coughs> <coughs> Hello, can anyone hear me? Hello, yes, we can hear you. We are from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you's Baltazar? <laughs> Momo? <laughs> I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Baltazar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes! I'm not doing that anymore. We are safe. We found a way up. <laughs> Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to go to the sewers to reach us. Sounds like a lovely time. Very dangerous. Zerks everywhere. <laughs> sewers? How? Hello? Darn it, we've lost a signal. I can't believe it, this is Baltazar is alive. He and the other outsiders managed to go up through the sewers? The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums, but if Baltazar made it, there must be a way. I'm, I, I feel like that's rude to Baltazar. Dot, dot, dot. He looks like a fisher. Oh wait, he was the sun, wasn't he? You never get past the sewers. It's infested with zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you. Especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you. Your business is none of my business. Hmm. Seamus. His father, Doc, used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test a device and never came back. Seamus has never been the same since. Don't listen to Seamus. He's just scared like I was. If Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in Seamus' apartment. Come on, follow me. I must be a cat. No, get back here. I must walk in front of your feet. My cats are going to get, like, squashed Ooh, one day. Oh, you can translate that. Oh, yeah. My cats are going to get squashed one day. Mm -hmm. Announcement. I am looking for any sheet music to play guitar. 
to add some ambiance. If you find any, please bring them back to me. I live near the elevator. Marusuke. Hmm. Come on, Seamus, open the door. You know your father would have wanted to help us. Or wanted... Did he no say response. wanted to? Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Seamus. He doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you. I think I have an idea. A very conveniently cat-sized hole. <laughs> Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to Seamus. Gained a new item that we already had. Mm -hmm. It contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communication with the others. Okay. Go in the hall! Mm. Hey, he has one too. What are you doing in here? I told you, getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. <laughs> Would you like some sheep? Would you like an energy drink? <coughs> <coughs> What's this? Wait, is this my papa's? Oh, wow, I never knew. There's a secret room in here in our flat? But where? All right, we have to find it for him, right? A secret lab right under my nose. Maybe there are clues hidden somewhere around here. Oh. Ha ha ha. Just knocking all over his stuff. Aw, oh, look. It's very much looks like a Back to the Future reference. Oh, does it? Yeah. Time will tell. Oh, uh, a clock. <laughs> it's just the clocks. Oh, <laughs> uh, didn't we have to, like, remember the, um... There's other things you can press triangle on. <laughs> wow! Oh, and then the clocks told the code. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, what do we got? Two. I've never noticed the digicode before. How did I miss it? Oh, button. <laughs> I have no idea what the password could be. Uh, it's right behind you, sir. Uh, two, five, one, I can't one, see. I guess. Yeah, two, five, one, one. All right, go ahead. Two, no, two, five, one, one. Good, yeah. I can read clock. <laughs> Did he never wonder why they had so many clocks? <laughs> <laughs> and none of them are at the correct time. He's like, wow, dad sure liked clocks. Yeah. I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for the Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went to the outside to the slums and never came back. All right, now you just gotta look around. Are they dead? That's dead, yes. Okay. So I remember there was like living ones. Why did they need coffee? Good question. It's probably just left over from before. Oh, uh, yeah. People lived here before, after all. Robots news headlines. Zerk are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal! Dang. There we go. <gasps> Hello. <laughs> Hello, I dropped it right at your feet. You have the broken tracker. Find anything interesting in here? Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find out where he went. I can't believe my Papa might still be alive. I missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My Papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slums should be able to help. Come with me. I'll open the door for you. Just kick that I'm gonna box. We're going to take that box while we go, too. Mm -hmm. Very important. <laughs> Socks! 
Box? There's a box that has socks on it. <laughs> you gotta fix that tracker. You're resourceful. Maybe you can find someone in the slums to help. All right, let's go find him. I do love knitting. So far I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. I have Josh's grandma's like that. <laughs> if you bring me some electric cable, I could make you a poncho. You poncho. inspire me, but it's not easy to find the right materials around here. Poncho cat. cable the best on the market i'll exchange this for a super spirit detergent that's the best i can do are you one of those troublemakers playing with the paint buckets on the roof Keep your paint away! I'm tired of cleaning my stoop because of your mess. Do you have any electric cable for me? I'd love to make a poncho for you, but I need that cable. Yeah, we can hook you up. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Yeah, <laughs> and she knitting. Oh, thanks, hey, Grandma. Poncho. There you go, little one. It'll suit you well. It's not for me. Oh. Thank you. Oh, Grandma. Oh. <laughs> Elliot Programming. Finally. <laughs> knock on the door and wait for us to open. I cannot knock. I have no fists. Let me in. Quick. Oh, it's Elliot. What's up, Elliot? Been looking for you. You look cold. Oh, he's cold. Yes? Can I help you? Oh, wow. That's a great tracker. I recognize this model. It's a Tahima BR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? Sure thing. I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. You're a robot, sir. I can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Sir. Here you go. Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. My grandma made it. Let me try it on. Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks, now I can definitely fix your tracker. Yeah. Let me take a look. Just gotta give it an update and one more thing. 
Pull up! Yeah! Game new one. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you're looking for. Thank you. We. Why are you shivering, sir? Stop, Lily. You're a robot. Why do you shiver? He's still cleaning up that paint. And there he is. Mm. Hi, man. Did you manage to fix the tracker? Yes, I did it all myself. Yep. Because I am a cat. <laughs> you did it! You fixed it! Well done! Give it here. Yeah. We got a ping! All right. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it! Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. Let's go. You have a fishing vest. Is that a fishing vest? It's a puffy jacket. Oh, okay. I thought it was a fishing vest for some reason. It's very Back to the Future. He wears like a puffy, red puffy vest, I think. Like ah. this. And Doc looks like Doc from Back to the Future. Yep. So I think that's kind of the intended reference. Food prints. Oh, he didn't leave any. I did though. The cat footprints are really what matters anyway. <coughs> yes. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. It's dangerous to go. Here, take this. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be dangerous. The outside world awaits us. Here we go. Cat doesn't mind. No, cat will go out there. Cat is brave. As long as cat remembers what button to mash, cat yes. will okay. <laughs> Cat is brave with the right buttons. <laughs> um, this would be a good time. Maybe not quite yet. Tall person. Gonna help us? Look at all these Zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He'll know that you're a friend. Outsider badge. I'll open the door for you. All right. Cat judges you. The humans don't, but cat judges you. And now, on to a whole new mission. Next time, we explore. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> He's purring. <laughs>